And for your health this morning, we're talking about our kidneys. According to health experts, New Mexicans are more prone to chronic kidney disease compared to most states. They also say 90% of people who have chronic kidney disease don't even know they have it. So in honor of National Kidney Month, Brianna Wilson talked to a health expert about the risk factors you need to watch out for. And we like to use this time to, to raise awareness to a condition that affects some 37 million Americans, so that's 15% of the adult population, chronic kidney disease. New Mexico is one of only 14 states to have above average rates of four main causes of chronic kidney disease. Those are diabetes, prediabetes, obesity, and end-stage renal disease, or ESRD. In which someone would require either dialysis or a transplant for a survival kidney disease is around two individuals per thousand of your population. That's roughly 3% of New Mexicans. If these risk factors are in your family's medical history, that also increases your chances of developing kidney disease. So how do you know when to get checked out? Well, as it turns out, chronic kidney disease is a silent disease, meaning that oftentimes there aren't symptoms until the disease has progressed uh, um, to a great extent. But that doesn't mean there aren't signs. Kidneys maintain our water and electrolyte balance by removing waste and extra fluid from our bodies. So when they're not working properly... One can become anemic, uh, therefore fatigue easily, not have the normal exercise tolerance. You may also want to get tested regularly if you have any of the risk factors we mentioned earlier, as well as high blood pressure, heart disease, or hypertension. This is a simple test, it's a blood test and a urine test to, uh, to give you that peace of mind. There are a number of treatments and medications for people who do have chronic kidney disease. You can also boost your kidney health by exercising for just 30 minutes a day, five days a week, eating more nutritious foods, and getting plenty of sleep. We now know that between seven to eight hours of sleep for adults are not only good for our physical and mental health, but also for our kidney health. Brianna Wilson, KOB4.